Hello, my dearest, and Happy New Year. So I thought I would make a little video today showing you um, one of my favorite gifts that I received um, from my husband. And it actually is from Lush, which was wonderful. And he knows me so well. He got me this beautiful box. It is the My Fair Lady um, box, and it comes, it came with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven beauty items, um, and one sample. And this really pretty box that was wrapped in this purple bow that was made a wonderful Christmas present under the tree. Right, and I'll just open it up. Um, I think a few of my items are actually scattered about. Um, one's in the shower, but maybe I'll run and get them. So, first off, there is the Charity Pot. Um, and this is a hand and body lotion. And let's see. And it is smooth, creamy, skin softening, cocoa butter, and almond oil lotion with a scent that makes life worth living. Makes your body feel lovely and your heart feel glad. Apply generously, use it up quickly, and buy a new pot. Wow. It's a good sales pitch. Use it up quickly. Um, I guess I won't get too too upset since this is a charity pot and Lush donates 100% proceeds from the sale of charity pot towards charities, groups, and good causes around the world. We even donate the ingredients, packaging, and the overhead costs to make the product. Wow. So this, this little pot of lotion is all for charity and it does have a lovely scent. I don't really think it smells like cocoa butter. Um, maybe a little bit like almond. But it has kind of a citrusy s smell to it. Um, and that's just Charity Pot. I, I guess that's the name of the fragrance. Yeah, Charity Pot Body Lotion. Okay, the next item, um, and it came in this box with all these little uh, packaging foam things, crunchies. I don't know. Um, the next we'll do is this little tiny hands hand serum. Melt this marigold and chamomile bar between your palms to soothe and nourish dry hands. And it does smell pretty good. I'll go ahead and open it up. Let's see. And this is kind of probably I would imagine that this is a lot like their um, massage bars if you've ever used those before, because you kind of just rub them in your hands and it kind of makes it greasy, so it just glides really smoothly and very moisturizing. Yeah, that's. Hmm, this does have a lovely scent. It's very fresh smelling and a little citrusy. I do smell the chamomile. I guess the marigold. It's kind of flowery smelling. But yeah, that feels nice. Very moisturized feeling. Almost like, I don't want to say greasy, but a little greasy. That's nice. Okay, it came with that. And then we have this Ultra Balm sample. I mean, it says Ultra Balm Sample. It says, our fabulously effective multi-purpose balm with endless possibilities for soothing and calming skin. And at this point, this is all-purpose balm for all your bits. I'm a little confused as to how to use this. I've been using it as a lip, like a lip balm. See, it's very, very, very creamy. Almost like a lotion kind of creamy. So I've been... I want that autofocus. I've been a little nervous to use this anywhere else. I guess you could use it. It says all your bits, so I'm thinking that means like you can even use it on your hands, elbows, things like that. But really, I'm not sure. I've just been using it as a little lip balm, so maybe I should do some more research and figure out what that's for. It does have a nice smell. It's kind of not too, too scented. Let me see. Yeah, it's really not that scented. Okay, we'll just close that back up. Alright, and my next little item here is this soap. And it's kind of has like a dark color on one side of it and orange on the other. And this is the figs and leaves soap. Creamy, scrubby orange blossom soap with whole figs for a skin softening wash. So I guess that the brown stuff in here is actual um, figs. And I'll just see about opening it up. Let's see. And then I really, what I love most from Lush is their bath bombs. So I kind of thought it was funny that 
my husband got me this box because it didn't have one bath bomb, like one bath fizzy thing in it. So, but he did get me another box. Well, not a box. He just got me like a, like a present. I'll show it to you real quick. It came in this cute little box. That's still wrapped up and it's buttercup and it comes with a honey I washed the kids soap and one butterball bath bomb. So he did get me one bath bomb but I love Lush stuff so I was happy like I get to try out all these new products that I probably never would have bought unless someone got them for me. So that was nice. So I've opened the soap. I'll let you see. And yeah it does have like whole figs in it. It's kind of kind of weird. All that's like almost looks like a brownie or a piece of chocolate fudge, but it smells. Um, I don't really know what that smells like. I guess figs, maybe. I don't know what it doesn't really like. It's not citrusy, it, just, it smells good, not bad. I guess it kind of smells like natural, herbally, maybe. Yeah, so got that. Um, and then let's see. So our next item um, is the almond and coconut smoothie shower smoothie. Um, and it is just kind of like a pureed, a beautiful vanilla and yuling ling shower smoothie to soften, gently cleanse, and perfume dry skin. Take a generous scoop and smooth it all over for an exotic shower experience. And this, I love the smell of this. It just smells so like vanilla and coconut an almond and it's, it has this really really thick formula um, I say really thick but it's almost like a yogurt like a little thicker than yogurt maybe like Greek yogurt I um, mean you just scoop it out I've already used a good bit of this um, and I just got it for Christmas but it's a great product it's just an almond coconut smoothie um, and it comes in the same little pot and if you bring five of these back to Lush you get a free face mask so if you collect those that's something good to know um, let me see if it says anything else on this. Yeah, it just says it's a silky, soft almond and coconut whip soap for the smoothiest bodies. And it does make your legs, after you shave, really smooth. Um, and then another one product, another item, was the Olive Branch Shower Gel. And it has olive oil and mandarin juice, peacemaking shower gel. Lather all over your body and your hair when you're in a hurry. I didn't know you could use it for your hair, but this is like a really nice smelling... Uh, shower gel and it kind of separates as you can see when it's in the bottle it has like the white on the top and then orange so you just shake that up before you use it um, that smells really lovely and then the last item is the Buffy and I actually keep it stored in an old body shop body butter container to keep it dry um, this is wonderful. This is the Buffy Body Butter Exfoliating Body Conditioner to give you the smoothest backside ever. Um, and what you do is you just take this into the shower with you, um, put water on it. I, I like to use it after I shave, like right before I get out. Put water on it, lather it up, put it all over your body, and then um, rinse off. Rinse off, and then once you turn the water off, just kind of dab your body with the towel um, just to get the water and it leaves like almost like this really nice moisturizing oily finish um, so it's great for your body I would kind of keep it away from your face just cuz I it probably I don't know if it breaks you out or not but yeah those were the items um, one two three four five six seven items and that's my fair lady um, gift box and let's see and it just has a really nice box that I can reuse uh, again it's really florally. It even tells you who packaged your box on a sticker right there, which I thought was kind of neat. And also says that on all the products, it tells you um, who they were made by and what day, so you know like how fresh your items are. I thought that was really nice. So yeah, if you're interested in a Lush, Lush products, I would try getting one of these boxes just to, it's almost like a great way to sample a lot of products at once, just to get an idea of what kind of products you like. And then I'll just put these up here. Yeah, so that's it. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you could like if you did or not if you don't, that's fine. But I hope you have a wonderful first month of your new year. Thanks for watching. Bye.